Hey, welcome back, everyone. This is Everyone Loves Pirates, and we are playing my Swedish Ancestry series that I've been playing for a while on YouTube. So hopefully everything looks all right. We're going to be Twitch streaming this, and if anyone happens to come by, we will interact with them, and otherwise it's just going to be a normal episode. And I just, the big thing is I have to keep track of my time. So last time what we did is we started attacking this lady up here, I believe, because they're headed over there. So let's get... Game started. We'll go to two times speed. And I'm honestly not particularly sure what all needs to be done. All right, we had a daughter. Good Norse child. Child of a concubine. Sounds good. We wiped out her army. We're suffering a lot of attrition, so I'm going to take this army and kind of split it off a bit. This is all my troops, too, isn't it? 500? Well, I guess we'll leave 1,000 then. Okay, put that back together. Split it off. And grab those. And we'll move these back. Hopefully the attrition won't kill them faster than they can take that down. And what's next? So... Our religion stuff, where is our counselor here? She is in Cornwall. Uh-oh, I'm starting to feel ill. Uh, Cornwall, that's on the other side of the sea. Good, that's a good place. We do have a lot of stuff we need to work with over here. And I like to see my truces. 1919, 1917, so that one's um, a year away. 1918, 1917. Ah, okay, so we can come over here and take... Is that his final province? Looks like it. Oriole and Tyronicel, whatever it is, will not be able to help him. Oh, we're being sieged over here. We're being raided. Really? You're raiding me. Jerk. Why didn't we get a pop-up about that? Oh, we actually don't own this. That's one of our vassals. I'm tempted to go help him, but that's going to be a nasty thing to go do. But technically, we should be hostile towards him. Or hostile, even. So, oh, why are we paused? I guess because I was worried about that. So what we could do is bring these guys over here and just kind of siege through his lands. We'll be hostile to him for, um, for six months, I believe. Yeah, why not? Okay. For another 182 days, it said. As long as he keeps on raiding over here, that'll do it. Okay. Let's see. How does our vassals feel about us? We got this leader of this revolt, and we got a dude in jail. Can we have a blot? Apparently not. We can commission a runestone. I was thinking about doing that before, wasn't I? Hey, we're not ill anymore. That's great. Uh, yeah, let's commission a runestone. And I think the type of guy we are, we're going to have it definitely speak of me. And actually, Red Talon is here. He's in the chat. And chat is very laggy, I know. And so occasionally I want to talk to him. And he doesn't know the country. So blah, blah, blah. I don't either. I'm assuming it's this one. Yeah, let's try it of ourselves. So we can speak of our sharing because we're charitable. We can mention being kind. I didn't realize we were such a good character. Or proud. Our greatness. We definitely need to be proud. And really, we need to start working on probably raiding some ourselves. All right. Our spy master has grabbed some technology in. Let's see, there's tech. What is it going to be in? 
I, w- I think it was in economy. I wasn't really paying that close attention. Speaking of tech, what can we get? We can bump up shipbuilding. If we do that, it'll give us 30% more galleys and unlock some stuff that we can buy. Sieging would be actually quite nice to bump up a bit. That's only going to cost us 40 that's going to cost us quite a bit. I'd rather spend huge amounts probably on military organization. And I don't know. I kind of save them for a long time, and I probably shouldn't. I mean, I don't know. That's the kind of stuff I'd rather deal with off camera, I think. It just takes too long for me to decide what to do. However, we do need to look at maybe doing some raiding. So we should be able to raid over here. I don't really think there's much these guys are going to be able to do about it. Yeah, they're pretty weak. And technically I believe we do border there, so we shouldn't need our ships even, at least for that province. So after we go mess with him... Oh, he's still Old Norse. I wonder if, since he's Old Norse, I wonder if we can raid him. Let's, let's try it and see what happens. That's probably why he can raid us, actually. He shouldn't be able to raid us if we were the same. It's raining outside. Red Talon says the best way to show you're kind is just tell people that you're kind. I agree. Hey, I'm a nice guy. Trust me. I'm definitely not going to have your wife murdered and your children enslaved. Okay, so we are sieging him. I don't know if we're actually looting him. And actually, we probably can't loot him. So Lotharangia has declared holy war for Luxembourg on Count Bruno of Loon. What religion are you? Oh, you're Wald Waldensian, a heresy of Catholicism. Very interesting. Uh, so, yeah, actually, we do border him there. But it doesn't seem like we are able to loot. Well, I think that's because of the high fort level, though. Let's see what happens. So the runestone is raised that we've commissioned. And it says, Us, poor Stein the Great, even though I'm pretty sure that is not pronounced as a P, who was once favored son of Vaughn and Ermentrude. Ugh. Uh, raise this stone to honor the legacy of his famous deeds. In the world of men, no one was his equal. Quite. It's perfect. So we get 300 prestige for that because we were proud and talked of ourselves. And for a little bit, we'll get some diplomacy and general opinion. I like it. So it'll take a little while, but we will burn down his villages, make him regret ever attacking us. Yeah, you just stay over there and attack my vassal. That does not bother me at all. It's raining quite hard here, actually. Uh, we're almost done with this war. And when we're done with that, we'll go loot over here. Actually, we do have this retinue. Bring it over. Uh, the defenders launched something. Yeah, we don't really need people... Man, it's raining hard. Uh, leading this, so go away. It's... Middleburg? Hey, Middleburg. Where is Middleburg? Yellow, but you can't click on it. This is probably Middleburg. Nope, that's not Middleburg. Is this Middleburg? That is also not Middleburg. Is this Middleburg? Yes, that's Middleburg. Okay. That's fine. We'll stop launching unsuccessful raids. I need to open this up, by the way. I know it's going to be difficult for you guys to read the small text, probably. but Oh, wow. They raised troops from where? Oh, this is not good. This is not good at all. They, she brought in help? Ugh. Well, darn it. We're going to have to leave that guy alone for a bit and come deal with this man so much siege progress lost so many troops as well 
Let's just run away. It actually didn't hurt the war score very much. But we can't enforce our demands, so. Middleburg is being defeated. So our niece, whom apparently we are educating, even though we have all sorts of stuff up here I should be paying attention to. Uh, we will make her temperate. Why not? I should have looked at actually that other thing. Uh, three children lack a guardian. So who are you? You are my nephew. You are my half-sister. You are also my half-sister. Well, let's look at our vassals here for a second. She doesn't have any vassals. And Jarl Smalland, leader of the revolt. Chiefess of Cornwall. I think I'd rather get some other guys much higher than those low guys up. So we have Cheers. And how about this Jarl? Our ne oh, he obviously can't do it. We have a nephew in charge of that duchy. Okay, a young kid. Gotland guy. Yeah, you. You are going to educate. Our... Darn it. What was he? Ragnar. Let's see if we can do it this way. Oh, we have room left still. Well, let's educate our nephew. And our half-sister can be educated by Girl of Gotland. I should make him like us more. Unless he's not close enough. Yep. That helped. And the last one, let's get that educated by another person who's of high rank that needs to like us more. Got all the Jarls. Okay, that's fine. Great. That's on inheritance warning. Levy's raised too long. We're dealing with that. De jure claims. Nine titles could be created. Title loss in succession. Important events. Uh, we can strip ships because we're at war. That's a problem. That's why you were mad about your levies. Okay. Oh man, it takes forever to walk anywhere here. And we are at speed two instead of speed three, which we should be. Who are you? Well, you're not doing anything, so I guess I'll leave you alone. Oh, why does it take so long to walk everywhere? Let's get some people in charge here. Okay. You. Oh, wow, this is a weird makeup. Okay, let's switch this around. There we go. You, you, and... Anyone with any actual skill? Flatland, Viking... Oh, that's us. Um... Yeah, we're going to deal with this ourselves. We're going to... Actually, yeah, we're just going to lead that flank. We'll let, the, we'll let him take lead on this. Oh, wow. It's taking them so long to move that their morale is already back up. How close are we to getting there? 26th of December? Wow, that's going to take forever. Makes me wonder if maybe we should wait and send them both in at the same time. 
Battle of Uppsala. Someone came in here and took care of that. Oh, we did it as we were going through to go raid. Uh, well, we're already hostile to these people, and they have all their troops over here, so... Yeah, what the heck, let's raid some. I think we'll be fine even coming into here. Vesterbotten. Yeah, so there's no river crossing. We'll send these 500 straight back in, maybe. Okay, he's still messing around. And we're paused. That would be why. December 14th, December 2nd. Um, he's okay meeting us there, apparently. I'm confused. Okay, well, he died. Who took over for you? Oh. Like that. Yeah, we'll get Gallery to like us more, I guess. Okay, they're dead. Truces are expiring. Excellent. I forgot I did that. That's good. That's helpful. Now they're going here. Well, we might as well follow. So they're going to die quite handily, I believe. Yes. The death scream is quite nice, as Red Town points out. Holy crud, we're going to lose this too? How? Uh. They have huge bonuses, possibly. It may be a Sumanusko defensive thing. Yeah, they have a high defense. Well, darn. And these guys aren't going to get there in time. March 6th. Wow. Okay. I completely underestimated these guys. Crazy. Okay, our military, our retinues are set to... To refresh, I think what I'm going to do is just raise pretty much everything. All my vassal armies. And we will go in... At least everything that's nearby. Of course, I'm not getting a whole lot of levies from these guys. They've had a break a little bit. Oh, there we go. Those are some of my levies. Probably been faster to get rid of, to raise everybody and get rid of the ones on the other side of the sea, but that'll work. Actually, do we have a crossing from there? We do not. Our niece has come of age. Actually, she's a pretty decent character. Oh, 
All right, some more people are being converted. Vesterman land has been converted. Wow, lots of people are being converted. Bedford has been converted. Cornwall still hasn't been converted all the way yet. But it's looking better. Our courtier. We believe she's starting to fancy us. She is awfully attractive. And this character has been quite amorous. So I think we will... Her husband's dead. Yeah, let's make a move. I went to her chamber and gave her a good tumble. It's good to be the Vilkir? And we have fallen in love. Did we not love anybody yet? Oh, now we have two lovers. Excellent. <laughs> we can love a lot of people. Okay, so our truces have expired. Oh, we've got more kids that lack guardians. Who are you? My niece... I think people just keep dying. Oh, we can take Gelray up to 100. There are you. And our nephew. Twin. Our wife. Actually, that's an interesting idea. Where is our wife? I want to see how much she likes us. I guess I could have done it the other way. Yeah, she likes us a lot. Never mind. It's always nice for your wife to like you, especially when you have multiple lovers and concubines and stuff. Uh, Nordland. There you go. This should have been done so long ago. Okay, you who live probably over in England. Yep. Holy War for Lothian. Okay, so you're moving into Scotland now, huh? Great. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. We're not going to help you, but we'll say yes. Open council position, of course, because somebody moved. The Jarl of Bernslagen wants to become king. Don't know if I really want him on my council then. You, however, want to become marshal. And this will get you also up to 21. He's ambitious. But he likes us quite a bit. That'll keep him liking us. Uh, we're going to let him lead troops, though, for now. Because I want some really good... Guys going in and beating up these stupid Sumanuscos. So yeah, the issue was, um, besides the fact of their defensiveness, we went in there with almost complete, just, you know, only archers. Yeah, he's going to kill that guy pretty quick. So we're going to have a 6 to 1... Really? You're going up there? You know what? Go away. I don't need that group. Oh, we gotta turn off the looters. Merge. And... Oh, yeah, I guess those are the top three. Works for me. This ends now. So as a reformed pagan, we don't get the, uh, you know, we're going to have to deal with these vassal levy issues. Wow, everyone's dying. Uh, you want to become steward? Of course you do. No one actually wants to become a chancellor. You do. You already like us a lot, though. I think you'd only be 16. This guy will be 17. 
And I much prefer his traits, so I'm going to take him. What were we even doing with you? I think what we need to do is fabricate some claims, because I don't know if we have any... Cast his belly to attack some of these people. They're Old Norse, which gives us a claim, but they could just convert back over. We really should start moving over here. Who is your liege? Apparently we can't even look at what we can do. Um... Yeah, I kind of want the rest of Norway and stuff, at least. So we do have a Cassus Belly against him. We have one against her. We have one there. They're just going to be against the Old Norse. And part of me just kind of wants to not have them immediately turn Norse and end the war. So let's, let's fabricate a claim there, since that guy's a jerk. Okay, and I don't know exactly how long we've been recording, but I'm guessing it's pretty close. So I want to get over here, destroy her. I might even just assault through her holdings. Nah, that's... We have over ten, but... The, this battle alone might be enough. Oh, you're going to run away now, jerk. Okay, that's fine. Three to one. Yeah, I thought you might stay there. Okay, we're going to get there September 3rd. Send the other half in. Hopefully, if nothing else, if we lose this still... I mean, three flanks against their center. This should be pretty easy. There we go. And we wiped him out completely. Perfect. And you know what? I am going to send these in and assault. We're just going to end this. I'm sick of this war. A lot of these troops are mine, but a lot, you know, a few of them were my vassals as well. So our nephew was at play with another child yesterday and noticed that he didn't want to share his toys. So we can make him greedy or lecture him and he possibly becomes charitable. He's become charitable. Excellent. See, I could just burn her stuff down if I toggled these as looters first, but... Yeah, it's only four gold. Let's not worry about it. It's not a temple or anything. So he accepted the peace offer. Being what? Uh, where's Loon? I thought it was way over here. Our niece has become just. I'm okay with that. Loon, Loon, Loon. I'm not seeing it. Okay, whatever. So we're going to finish this battle. I'm going to put those together. Just salt. Favorite kind of peanut, assaulted. Okay. Enforce demands. It's now part of our land. We own it, so we need to give it away. So we need to find men who are not rulers and of our religion and culture and not of a great house. Do it by stewardship. Uh, steward of Bernslagen. Our steward is only a 10? Well, this will put him... Probably directly under us. We 
And maybe we'll be able to take him as our steward. Uh, Lapland. Nice. He likes us quite a bit. If he dies, we're his heir. This little chief. Well, maybe not. This part of a duchy. Oops. Ah. Man, I can't hit any of the right buttons today. Duchy of Norland is not created. Okay. I don't really want to anyways. Okay, great. So we have taken Lapland. That was much, much harder than it should have been. But uh, thanks for watching. I'm in this episode here, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.